Freshman the morning, and it was pouring rain, and I'd had to go hand, hand it down, and um, and Padre got heat, and I wrote a few lines about Padre, you know. I can read my writing. Eighteen eighty seven, Saint Catherine's tree. A boy he was born that would make history. The first son of Marley, his father was John. He was Padre O'Keefe, now the pride of Long Con. His love for the music came from Uncle Cal, and soon the old fiddle became his best pal. Inspired by his people and the pure Long Con air, Patrick started composing and the music flowed clear. Oh, never have we heard such music so pure. His style was unusual, and one thing is sure. For slides and for polkas, now for me believe. No one can compose them like Patrick O'Keefe. A life of school teaching was not for O'Keefe. It was music, his first love, his only relief. His pupils were blessed to be taught by this man. A master of music, O'Keefe from downtown. A love for the Rani in the sadly in tears. And so the fiddle, his wife, for the rest of his years. Padre brought his sweet music wherever he went, and it trod every pub with his humor and wit. In Tom Fleming's bar at a session one night, the crack it was mighty, Nell's fire was the light. Then the whole pub fell silent, everyone was drawn in. When Padre O'Keefe started playing his violin. <laughs> now every October in Castle Island Town, at every session and PJ's handed down. Though we lost dear old Padre in 1963, his music will live on for eternity. Church's music so pure, his style was unusual, and one thing is sure. First lights and for poetess, now many believe no one could compose them like Patrick O'Keefe. Oh, the pride of Sleeve Lucra is Patrick O'Keefe. <laughs>